Welcome back to Let's Play FTL Fast and Light. I'm Nye. Gonna do another new game here. Let's see, what do we need to do? We need the Zoltan Cruisers Type B, we need the Rock Cruisers Type B, and we need the Stealth Cruisers Type B. Uh, I'm gonna try the Stealth Cruiser again, because I actually kind of like the way this ship runs. Uh, not incredibly much, uh, honestly, but um, it has a kind of cool uh, style to it, so gonna try it out again. Uh, what we really need to see in this thing is a early set of shields. If I can get early she- <laughs> Wow. This map. Uh, if I can get an early set of shields, we will be in really good position to get a lot of cool stuff going on. Uh, if not, we're absolutely boned and, uh, immediately get forded, okay? Sure, why not? You come up here just in case they need a second. Interesting way to start the, uh, start the game. But we'll get a little bit of fighting experience, uh, which is, uh, you know, gonna be good if I, s uh, choose to, um, uh, go with a boarding crew. Okay, let's get you two into the med bay immediately. And you're safe. Let's get you back in here. That could have been bad, but, uh, you know, got my guys into the cockpit fast enough to take care of that fight. Uh, the pilot didn't take any more damage than he had to, and, uh, apparently he got both both the kills, too, so he has plenty of fighting experience. Okay, let's get you up here. Let's get you up here. Unfortunately, as good as that, uh, you know, as that really was, we did not get, um, you know, any scrap off of it. Which, uh, still a little bit behind. Okay, so now we have an, uh, a ship's AI that we're going to deal with. We're going to do lasers to its, um, weapons, and we're going to do, uh... I need to dodge this thing. Awesome. Okay, so now it's not going anywhere. Let's get auto-fire on, because we actually do want that on this ship. And we'll take out this thing pretty easily. That was a pretty good fight. I liked that. Three fuel, a missile, and some scrap. Don't need the missile, but the uh, fuel and the scrap is welcome. Let's keep on jumping. Let's see, what do we have here? Uh, we... They want us to accept a bribe. We are not going to. Instead, uh, we are going to attack. Now, my hope is that we can actually kill these guys without too much trouble. Yeah, I'm just going to have to... I'm going to wait until they fire. Uh, four fuel, two drone parts. I'm not actually going to accept that uh, because... Oh, damn, we actually took that damage. I was kind of hoping their um, uh, beam would not be able to fire that quickly. Okay, let's get our beam to hit. Let's see if we can take down their weapons. We've got to take another shot off that beam. I can already see it charged. Actually, we're going to take a lot of damage. Wow. Okay. Uh, we resisted some of it, thankfully. And we did win the fight, but, um, only 14 scrap, really? Okay, but they patched us up. Okay, I can live with that. Let's get our, uh, cloaking device set up again. I'm going to start putting points into the cloaking device immediately, uh, even though we don't have the power to actually run the damn thing yet, because uh, we're going to need to be able to cloak as much as humanly possible during this. I can already see it. Unfortunately, even though we, uh, powered up the cloaking device, apparently it started off damaged. Uh, so we gotta repair a little more, but that's okay, because that means Brian gets a little bit more, uh, repair experience, which is okay. Let's jump to the distress beacon. I doubt I can do anything here, but let's try anyways. Giant alien spiders, skip that. I have yet to, e I've yet to get anything positive out of that event. Uh, we've never seen a blue event for it either. Uh, let's see. Two fuel for three drone parts? No. We're going to skip that. We're going to jump to this distress beacon. Put our, a little bit of distance between us and the rebels. Uh, beam weapon to cut this ship out. Awesome. One fuel, one drone part, 13 scrap. Uh, I would have uh, preferred a little bit more scrap. Uh, is that worth it? Yeah, actually. It looks like this is still out of rebel hands. Yep, definitely is. Perfect. Uh, and there is potential here for uh, us to get um, a second crew member is awesome. Dodge 
dodge that. Okay, so we're doing pretty okay here. Um, I've got, of course, remember to set up my uh, beam to actually fire at a decent time. You know, when my dual lasers have actually uh, done some damage. They're offering me a slave as tribute. Awesome. Got ourselves a rock crew member. Uh, so if I actually do get a crew teleporter, uh, we're, you know, we've got one of the members I'd need to actually make that worth it. Got ourselves an AI to fight. We've already had this fight. We already know how this one ends. Uh, so I'm not too worried about this one. I'm just going to wait for it to fire its missile, and we're just going to dodge that. Here we go. Dodging. We only have a 90% chance of evade, so there is a chance that we could fail to evade. Uh didn't this time, of course, and once I level up my uh, engines a little bit more, you know, that's not going to be a problem. Okay, one missile, one drone part, 11 scrap. I'm uh, still... Oh, that was probably... I did probably did not jump far enough, damn it. Uh, let's fight this ship, see what we can do. Dual lasers to the shields, kind of as usual. And I think this time I'm going to fire my beam a little bit like that. Excellent. That was actually really good. Let's see if we can get those. Nope, gonna take damage off of their beam. Not too much, thankfully. But it did take out my dual lasers, which is obnoxious. They're trying to escape. We're not gonna let them. Should be able to take them out pretty quickly. We're not taking a lot of damage, which is kind of nice. Yeah, those guys are gone. Awesome. Giving us two missiles, one drone part, 11 scrap. Uh, I need... I don't really need the... Uh, I, I need fuel is what I'm really going to need on this ship for the time being. Okay, so we're going to need to jump into the exit and then whatever our next sector is, there's going to be a quest marker. Two drone parts for eight fuel, done. Don't even have to think about it. Okay, I'm going to go to the Zoltan controlled sector. I'm going to try to go mostly green options this time, mostly specifically for uh, achievements for this ship. Okay, I'm going to hit that distress beacon in just a second, so we're not going to let that one wait too long. What are we going to find here? Drone recovery arm. Uh, it's something I would have liked to have on the Taurus uh, when we ran the Taurus uh, a couple episodes ago, but not something uh, we need on this ship. Uh, let's invite this guy to our crew. Awesome, got a Zoltan crew member. Let's uh, toss him into the weapons for now, I guess. Uh, I can't think of any better place to have him. And we'll keep on exploring. Doing pretty okay so far. But unfortunately, it looks like this is where that's going to end. Uh, luckily, our weapons charge up pretty quick. Uh, I need to... Actually, I just need to fire this immediately. Because uh, I need to be able to get their weapons offline which is not going to happen uh, fast enough. So we're going to take some damage off of that beam. Uh, and it's going to deal quite a lot of damage, I'm assuming. Uh, yeah, here it comes. This is going to hurt. Three damage. Uh, not as bad as it could have been. And we missed both our shots with our dual lasers, which is, uh, that is as bad as it could have been. Let's get these guys into sensors. No! Damn it. Taking plenty of damage off these guys. My uh, my primary means of evasion are, is completely broken. Okay, their weapons are offline. Okay, you... Actually, you stay in here. Take care of that. Uh, I am not accepting any deal these guys throw at me. They are going to take some damage. Why did my mini beam... No! Fine. Okay. We're still doing okay. Let's go ahead and take care of that problem. Their weapons are still not online, which is good. Okay. They're gone. That fire is kind of raging. Two fuel, two missiles, 19 scrap. We're doing, again, we're doing okay. Uh, I could be doing a lot better right now, but 
Are these fires ever going to go out in here? Because that rock river is just kind of, you know, pounding away. Okay, you know what? Both of you out. We're just going to do this the old-fashioned way. Because those fires are just never going to go away, apparently. Wow, they're even spreading. Come on. Go away. Anytime now. Good. Okay. A little bit of excitement. A little bit, you know, kind of fun, right? No, not fun at all. That was stupid and we should never happen again. Uh, kind of tempted to go to level 3 uh, cloaking immediately, but uh, I want to save up for shields. I really do. I think that we need to have shields to make this run at all doable. So, I want to save up for that. Remember, those are 150. Got some mantis that want to, that, uh, you know, they want to take a shot at the champ, basically. I repeat with more emphasis, they want to take a shot at the champ. Okay, dual lasers. Let's take out their weapons. Okay, they were not able to do anything to us, which is good. Unfortunately, we were unable to take their uh, shields permanently offline. I should probably be using my cloaking a lot more often than I am. Okay, they're going to be going down on the next uh, the next smack of our lasers. Took a little bit of damage. Damage that was probably needless. I need to be using my cloaking device more for... Uh, delaying their attacks than for dodging them because the dodging thing is just not working out tremendously well. Okay, got another set of guys who want to attack. Dual lasers to their weapons and then uh, we will mini beam uh, their shields, just like last time. That I could have dodged. So we make a point of doing that. You guys get in here. Their weapons are offline. So are their shields. Let's take, take advantage of that. And there goes them. Took a little bit of damage, uh, but not too much. Uh, I'm actually, I'm really pleased with where we are right now, just in terms of scrap. Need 150. We're getting close, though. I'm gonna hit this quest marker up, then make my way to the exit. Okay, got absolutely nothing here. Go to the quest marker. What are we going to find here? Can't do anything because we do not have a missile. Uh, let's hit up this ship location. Then I'm going to gauge if I want to go to this store or not. I don't think I'm going to want to, though. That's not good. Okay, it is my hope that I can do something against them here. Before I take damage off this drone, because you know I'm going to take damage off that drone. Awesome! Yes, that hit, that, that went exactly as planned. That was perfect. Okay, their shields are down. Which means I get to do this. They're offering me one missile, one drone, part 12 scrap. Not going to accept surrender off of that. We're going to take these guys out. I'm going to take a little bit of damage myself. But, uh, shouldn't take too much more than I just took. I could be doing this. Could be cloaking. Could be playing smart. But, you know, you guys know exactly how often I do that. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to go to that, uh... Pretty sure I'm not going to be able to go to that store. Yeah, not safe. So I'm just going to have to go straight to the exit. Because I can't fight my way out in the cloaking ship. Okay, we now have enough um, scrap to get ourselves a shield. So what I need is that right there. Okay. It feels like this game is starting to try to enable us. Okay, shields online. Now I'm going to sell the drone recovery arm because for obvious reasons we do not need that. I'm going to heal us up. And I feel accomplished. I feel like we're actually getting somewhere. You get out of there, get into shields. Okay. That is good. I like this. Okay, so let's jump to this distress beacon. And we'll start working our way out from there.
What do we find? Uh, let's give these guys fuel. Why not? They give me a burst laser mark too. Um, that's that's pretty okay. Uh, not as good as some of the stuff I have had before, but um, not bad. Let's see, nothing here that I care about. I, mean, I can actually do anything about is a better way to put that. I actually care about some of that stuff, but I can't use it. Okay, got ourselves a fight here. They have... <laughs> they have... Okay, they have two drones. Now, I have shields, so I think it's more important that I take out their drone control than it is that I take out their weapons. Because my shields can actually do a little bit of a... A little bit of work on these guys. And of course, uh, everything bad happens at the same time. You get in here, get those weapons back online. We need them online yesterday, for all intents and purposes. Cloak up. Dual lasers online. This would be a time when, uh, yeah, they're gonna jump. There's nothing we can do about it. Okay, so we're running a little bit behind, as usual. No, I'm not going to accept that. I need my fuel. I shouldn't have offered fuel in the last time people asked for fuel. Let's attack this pirate. Hopefully we'll be able to get something out of this. Set this up here. Go invisible, so that way he can't charge his weapons. Feels if my play has gotten marketably worse uh, when um, fighting this type of enemy. Okay, we need to take out that those shields. Those are our primary concern right now. That's gonna hit for two damage. Okay. I should not have let mini beam uh, actually fire. That was bad. That was bad, and I should feel bad. I'm right, gonna get hit by this again. Two more damage. Mini beam. Across, we're going to take care of that. Okay, so we got the guy off the cockpit, so apparently we're doing enough damage to concern these guys, which, I mean, we are. Uh, there's there's no doubts about that. They're about to go down. No, we're not going to forgive you guys. Uh, hopefully I'm going to get that fuel anyways. One fuel, okay, that paid for that. Plus, one missile, one drone part, and 14 scrap. Uh, not, um, not horrible, but I could have asked for a lot more. Especially when it comes to scrap. Okay, we need to attack this automated ship. Not because I need to go to the sensor station. No, we need to attack this automated ship so that way I can get um get some more scrap. Go invisible here, which is probably the wrong idea. Actually, this was one of those uh, times when I wanted to not go invisible until they uh, until they were attacking me. Grab. Okay, only one missile hit. Good, I dodged the other one. Dual lasers to the shields. I actually need to hit with both of them to be able to do anything. Another hit. There's that. You get in there. Man, I'm just, I'm not hitting with my dual lasers, and I need them to hit in order for me to be able to uh, do anything, actually. Uh, that is another firm requirement, and they're dodging everything. I might just have to jump from this. Man! When it rains, it pours. Okay, that was what I was looking for. Luckily, we dodged both of their uh, missiles uh, without invisibility, too, which was pleasant. But this time, we are taking missile hits. I told Mini Beam not to attack. Why did it attack? Okay, that will work. Mini beam and their shields fail to go down. I'm not quite sure why. But that's absolutely fine. You know what? We'll, we'll live. I know they're saying they're saying they're going, no, you won't. I'm saying they're going, bite me. I will take you guys out. Okay. So took more damage than we should have, as usual. Not doing as well as we should be, as usual. All in all. Seems like my normal let's play.
Unfortunately, they are repairing at a decent clip. So, I could take a little bit more damage here. And, uh, looks like my laser shot something out of the sky, or... Maybe I should... I might have shot their drone. Maybe that's what happened. So, we're just waiting for our dual lasers to hit. Awesome. Okay. That's a win for us. Came at uh, too high of a cost, I believe. 18 scrap. Got ourselves a map. Did not need one. Would have liked fuel. What are we going to find here? We have people boarding our ship. You guys get in here. Uh, there's four of them. Actually, you should not be in there. That's a bad place for you to be. That's a bad place for you to be. Okay, well, hopefully that rock can just sort of hold out for a little while. Because he's got no choice. You get in there and fight. You get in there and fight. You get out of there and fight. You get in there and fight. You get out of there. You get out of there. You get out of there. We're playing round robin inside of there, I'll tell you that. Okay, you get in there. You get in there. You get in there. Awesome, we're winning. No loss of life on our part. Fabulous. You get in there. Okay, you get in there. Put a point of power in there. You get in there. Okay, what were you working on? You were a weapons dude, so I'm gonna let you go to weapons. Uh, you have been working on engines, so you can get your grease monkey butt back in there. And block, you just do your thing. All the power to you, sir. Okay, uh, let's see what's over here. Hoping to see some sort of achievement at some point. I don't think I'm going to be able to get any of the achievements. Uh, one of them is uh, dodge nine points of damage using um, uh, using cloaking. One is uh, kill all in one go on a cloak. And one is... Um, I forget what the other one is. Oh yeah, get to like sector... I think it's all the way to sector. I think it's all the way to the end without running into any environmental disasters. But this also means surviving to the end too which, uh, that's what we're having trouble with. Now, that said, we now have level 2 shields, so we're getting better. Got a defense drone I don't need, but I am able to put another point into engines, and now we can go to the exit. I don't think I've gone through any environmental disasters yet. We have no fuel. Of course we have no fuel. Yes, it is fortunate that our life support does not rely on FTL cells. Okay, apparently that guy was charging us, but we couldn't fight him for the fuel. That's fine. Uh, request emergency fuel reserves. We got two fuel. Now we can get the hell out of here into the Mantis controlled sector. And I'm probably going to really hate the Mantis Controlled Sector if I had to make a guess. Just kind of based on uh, recent events. Uh, we're going to have to go to a stress beacon because we don't have any scrap to pay for fuel. Send Rock Crew Member in. We get 22 scrap, one drone part, and two missiles. No fuel. Negotiate, which pisses him off. Okay, problem. We do not have the power to actually fight this guy. We have no way to get through his shields at all. So... We're just going to kind of sit here and wait for him to jump. And then we get to go back to waiting. Kind of a crappy event. Sort of waiting for our deaths here. I could just turn off my shields and let him kill us. I mean, it would have about the same, uh, same result. 
because the rebels are going to catch up to us pretty soon. Again, I'm not quite sure how some of these ships are supposed to work. Come on, slug ship. Let's see it. It's taking this guy so long to charge his FTL. I mean, come on, dude. You can certainly do better than this. Maybe? What type of engines are you hosting on that thing, anyways? Okay, there it goes. Okay, it jumps. And we wait. Uh, pay 15 scrap for 5 fuel. That's actually not bad. We have had an event in the past where doing that exact, uh, that exact event, paying that much for fuel, actually he boarded our ship and uh, tried to damage us. Which is a crappy event to be sure. Let's what, let this fire go away. You know, we're actually just going to jump directly to this distress beacon. In the hopes we'll get something out of it. Let's cut this ship out. Three fuel and one missile. Okay, we are back on... Uh... Well, so much for getting that achievement. So we have no choice. We must go to an asteroid belt. The game is trolling us again. And there is no possible way for us to defeat this ship either. Don't know what to tell you guys. I mean, if they get hit by an asteroid, I can then dual laser and then maybe hit them with a, a mini beam at the same time. But they're dodging with the asteroids. Okay, so we got a little bit of damage on them. Now we gotta wait for the next asteroid. Which would have been then, but uh, I kind of sort of failed my timing on dual lasers. Okay, asteroid. Let's get another one going. Nope, shields came back up just in time to stop me from uh, doing my work there. Okay gonna wait again and take plenty of damage while I do so come on show me the asteroid nope didn't time it right frustrating dual lasers aren't ready for this one still taking damage Nope, didn't get him fast enough. The timing on this is, is obnoxious, it really is. It, you have to hit it exactly at the right time. Dual laser's not active yet. Okay, come on. Give me a asteroid. Looks like one of my dual laser shots got intercepted by an asteroid. Miss that one. Feels like my commentary's gotten tied to the same point of, you know, can I hit this? No. Can I hit this? No. How about this? Nope. That one missed. And there goes our ship. Can't say I didn't expect it. Uh, we didn't really get much out of this run at all. Um, still working. See you guys soon.